गुड मॉर्निंग स्टूडेंट्स बिफोर स्टार्टिंग द नेक्स्ट एंड लास्ट टॉपिक ऑफ दिस लेसन आई विल रिमाइंड यू ऑफ वॉट वी हैड रेड यस्टरडे यस्टरडे वी कम्प्लीटेड टू टॉपिक्स आर फर्स्ट टॉपिक वॉज एनिमल्स ईयर्स एंड इन दैट टॉपिक वी गॉट टू नो दैट सम एनिमल्स हैव एक्सटर्नल ईयर्स एंड सम डोंट हैव बट इट डजेंट मीन दोज एनिमल्स हु डोंट हैव एक्सटर्नल ईयर्स दे डोंट हैव ईयर्स The only thing they don't have is pinna. Pinna means your external ear. When your mama says you hold your ears, your your teacher says, which part you hold? Outer part of your ear. That part only called pinna. P i double n a. And our second topic was hair patterns on animals' skin. And we got to know that animals whose external ears are not seen have hairs. They have, don't have uh, that hair on their skin, and uh, those animals whose ears you can see, they have hairs on their skin. Okay. Now today I let you know which animal give birth to their young ones, means their babies, and who lay eggs. First, let's read the paragraph. If you were to meet an elephant, would you dare to touch it? Do you know that an elephant also has hairs hair on its skin? Can you tell which of the animals mentioned in the list lay eggs? Find out and write the names of these animals in the green box. Okay. So animals who can uh, who lay eggs we will write their name in this table. and which of the animals in the list give birth to babies write their names in the red box so these tables are given here okay you can see here we have not written names ears can be seen so just go through these names some names are given here and write those animals name here whose ears you can see and who has hairs on their skin hair on their skin in this table you will write the name of those animals whose ears you cannot see and those who has feathers on skin okay so now we will get to know that those animals whose ears can be seen and they will have hair on their skin those animals will give birth to their babies okay like cow dog cat these animals they can they give birth to their babies and these animals are called mammals who give birth to their babies they call they are called mammals and those whose ears are not seen and have no hair they lay egg they lay eggs okay now look again at the table of the previous page draw line under the names of animals whose names are in the green box put a circle around the names of those animals whose names are in the red box okay on the red box so what did you know those animals whose ears you can see have hairs on their body is a cow hai aapko ear dikhta hai to uski body par hair bhi hote hai these animals give birth to their young ones young ones means babies and those animals that do not have ears on the outside do not have hair on their body these animals lay eggs okay so this lesson of us and sir now i'm sending you one word answer and fill in the blanks you will write them in your notebook and then learn them okay Bye